but I think the Chiefs are just going to be on such a roll, and Patrick Mahomes is such a hard, hard person to stop. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll pick the Chiefs. Hey, hey, what it does. Oh, man. Oh, man. Six years ago, by the way, six years ago was Super Bowl 48, one of the happiest days of my life. The Seattle Seahawks won the Super Bowl. Ah, man. That just sounds so good. Seattle Seahawks, Super Bowl champions. Maybe next year. Maybe next year. But... We can all be happy because the Kansas City Chiefs have won the Super Bowl. Yes! (laughs) As you saw, I picked them. Okay, it was in part two when I re-picked after the wildcard games have happened. But I still had them in the championship game in the first one. And just the second one, because the team that I picked lost, I picked them to win. That's close enough, right? I, I got a couple right in this playoffs. I think in total I got like two right and it was the Chiefs well now this one three so I did okay I suppose I suppose I did okay (laughs) but thankfully thankfully we don't have to there's a dog in here hi whoa here show the masses hello this is the doggy this is Nazzy Hello? Mm. Yeah, you're a cutie. You're a cutie. Now you need to go back out, so one sec. Dog break. I don't know who won the puppy bowl. Do, do people win in the puppy bowl? Let's find out. Okay, quick quick search. Did not tell me who won in the puppy bowl. Anyway. Yeah, no, it's a good game. I mean... Thankfully, the 49ers lost. We can all appreciate that and their annoying fans. God, they're just... I'm sorry. Um, I mean, I'm, I'm sure we're annoying to them. It's vice versa. It's, it's That's sports, right? That's sports. But uh, no, it was a real interesting game. I mean, um, you know, originally, uh, you know, started good. The Chiefs, I thought, were looking good. Good. I didn't think they were looking great, you know, on the first drive, but it seemed like Mahomes was locked in. Um, yeah, and then, then, you know, uh, I thought the 49ers really um, subtly took over in the second quarter. You know, they got, they tied the game up. Um, you know, and going into 10 10, I was like, it was leaning to the Niners. Like, it looked like they were really driving, really having a good time. And, you know, Jimmy G was, oh, okay but the running game was good and it was strong the Chiefs didn't really have an answer for Debo Samuel um and then you know the second half happened and you know the 49ers were just running wild that defense was playing unbelievable they weren't allowing anything to happen Mahomes just seemed off that that first interception that he threw like Patrick Mahomes doesn't make that mistake he doesn't they don't so that was uh I, I thought it was a turning point, you know, and then they turned that into points, and, um, you know, and then the, then the second interception happened off the deflection off of Tyree Hill, and, you know, I even, I even texted my friend right then and there, I was like, this might be ball game. I didn't say it was ball game, but I said it might be game over, and then, you know, the, I don't know what it was, the Chiefs just found something. They, they, it's like, <laughs> I don't even know, it's just like they, they, they wanted to be here. They just wanted this situation. I mean, uh, Julie Stewart Binks on uh, Twitter, uh, she's like, the 49ers are idiots for giving the a 10 point, taking a 10 point lead against the Chiefs. Not wrong. <laughs> I mean, obviously, but but she's not wrong. And, you know, the, the Chiefs seem to thrive in that moment. They're just, they found their game. And you know what? The defense finally, it took them forever to figure it out that, What happens when you pressure Jimmy Garoppolo? Nothing. He can't do anything when he's pressured. He threw the interception. His first interception was like to pressure. Put pressure on the guy. He's not going to make it happen. And they stopped the run, which they had to. And look at what happened. Super Bowl champions. So, you know, I'm not... You know, I I think... I thought the 49ers, they... 
were doing everything they had to. They were doing everything they could. Just, you know, <laughs> they lost it. They came to the fourth quarter and just all of a sudden, you know, the Chiefs picked it up and the 49ers were just like, where am I? You know, it's unfortunate for Kyle, Chan- Kyle Shanahan, you know, he was part of that Falcons uh, disaster against the Patriots. And, you know, again, he's not quite as big of a disaster, of course, but they should have won this game. If they just kept playing the way they were playing, they'd, they'd have won the game. But like I said, the Chiefs found it. They finally started going to Tyreek Hill. Um, Damian Williams was absurd. I, um, among a lot of people, probably thought he he should have been the MVP after this game. I picked Patrick Mahomes. Um, but I mean, Damian Williams had a hell of a day. He was the reason those cleats, by the way, fire those Air Jordans. Um, but uh, no, like it, it was a good game, and I don't think you can ask for much more. Um, in in a in a Super Bowl, I and mean, we got last year's disaster, boring game. But you know this this year, I thought you know we, we had everything. We had good defense. Uh, I thought the offenses were sputtering, but then you saw that Chiefs brilliance, and you know the comeback. So you know there have been better Super Bowls for sure, but that was pretty darn good for a Super Bowl that um, just happened. So um, congrats to the Chiefs. Um, huge accomplishment for them. Fifty years, you know, haven't won since Super Bowl four. So, uh, good for them. Um, you know, yeah, you know, I know they're the, uh, they're the enemy, but sorry, Niners fans. And we, you know, I, everybody knows how it feels. It's not fun. Um, but, uh, the 49ers have a really good young team there. That defense is going to be good for a long time. You know, that, that offense, Debo Samuel's butting into something real good. So they, they got, they got to iron out some things, but they, they got a heck of a team. They got a young team too. So they got, they're going to go places as is this chiefs team. So probably be hearing about these guys for quite a while. Uh, quickly on the halftime show, yeah, a lot of people were talking about it, oh, so great, but I don't know, it was dancing, it wasn't singing, it was dancing, and then they brought those two guys who, from those two famous songs, and I couldn't tell you who they were, Bad Bunny, is he one of them, I don't know, I don't know, don't really care, it wasn't that great of a halftime show, whatever, sure people, and I'm not sure, I know, people loved it, but whatever, don't care, not my problem, um, no, it's exciting, uh, I'm excited, uh, you know, another NFL season gone away. Um, so we wait for next year. That's what's going to that, That's all we can do. Hopefully the Seahawks can come on next year and win. Thank God the Chiefs won. Tune in next week. XFL. If you haven't seen the XFL yet, this is the video link right here. So you can watch that. Um, those are some of the rules that are happening. The XFL starts on Saturday. We're, I think the first game has the Seattle Dragons in it. So I don't know. I guess I'm cheering for them. Uh, so exciting football's not over yet and hopefully the xfl might work out nevertheless cfl free agency started so we'll get into some cfl talk as well as torn state goes on thanks for watching what it does chiefs of super bowl champions we'll see you next week or later this week i guess it's sunday